Warning, read and follow all labels and the owner's manual. Replacing handle, switch, and neck for MDX MIG guns. Turn off welding power source, wire feeder, and disconnect gun. Remove four screws from the handle and retain for future use. Rotate locking cap counterclockwise one quarter turn to separate handle halves. If you are only replacing the handle, move ahead 1 minute 47 seconds in this video. Remove terminals from the trigger switch. Install new trigger and connect leads. Polarity is not important. If you are only replacing the handle and switch, move ahead to 1 minute 47 seconds in this video. Loosen lock nut on neck by using wrenches on the end fitting and lock nut. Use 3 quarter inch wrenches for MDX 250 guns and use 9 16 wrenches for MDX 100 gun. After the lock nut is loose, the neck can be unthreaded from the end fitting. Reassemble components in reverse. Thread neck back into end fitting. Make sure the neck is in line with the head clamp. Make sure the ball on the rear strain relief is positioned in the handle socket before closing. 